Good morning beautiful people. I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, Psychic Medium and Divine Channeler and this is the Daily Divine Guidance. Bringing you messages from the angels to see what you need to know to make the most out of today's energies. So uh, let's have a look and see what you need to know. I feel there's a real need to remind you that it's okay to not be okay and it's okay to have to take time for yourself it's okay to feel out of sorts it's okay not to feel happy smiley all the time you don't have to keep putting that brave face on you're allowed to feel sad you're allowed to feel out of balance show yourself some love look after you and know it is okay not to be okay Sometimes when you keep pushing yourself to be okay when you're really not, it just has this overwhelming effect of making everything feel worse and worse. Stop, breathe, look after you. Even if that means going to bed for an hour, look after you, recharge your batteries, do what you need to do to make you self, yourself feel better. And then everything will feel that little bit easier. So show yourself some love today and know it is okay. Give yourself that permission, okay? Feels really important. Okay. The first card out is focus. And I would say that energy of the card is focus on yourself. Focus on you, focus on what you need. Focus on Being the best you can be for you. Giving yourself the best you can. You may not feel like doing anything for yourself. You may just feel like curling up with a blanket in front of the fire and vegging out. And that is okay. It doesn't have to be some grand gesture of doing something for yourself. Just focus on you and what you need. Okay. Then we've got the study card. So I feel that people that are needing love from themselves and needing to remind themselves it's okay to stop, it's okay to look after you and it's okay not to feel okay. It's a bit of a life lesson and the angels are just wanting to remind you that you are your number one, you are your priority. And when you're feeling the best you can, the happiest you can, the most energized you can, everything will feel so much better and you can give what you need to do to those who who need it okay so make yourself the priority first then you will be able to help those that need a, a help around you then we've got the dreams card now we are coming up to the winter solstice so your dreams for the next year seem quite significant because as the as we approach the winter solstice we're letting go of the darkness and we're welcoming in the light and i feel the winter solstice is the best most powerful time of the year for making wishes setting intentions for the year ahead for the next five years whatever you want and you maybe as you're taking some time, you actually need to add that into what you're needing to do the next few days. Realize what you want and what you need in the next year. Even if that is more time for you, more freedom to do what you need to do to make yourself feel better. Have a think about it and make your dreams count. Set those intentions on Monday. Okay. And now I really want to pick at She Believes She Could So She Did card because I feel like there's a message in there for someone that they need to hear. Keep thinking about you. It's not selfish to be self-selfish sometimes. It's necessary. And the first card out is trust your inner voice. She is a goddess talking to you. Trust what you need for you. Look after yourself and then you'll be more able and have more energy to help those 
that you have around you. Okay, beautiful. Have a fabulous day. Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I am truly grateful for each and every single person supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please do take care, stay safe, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Namaste. Bye.